This guy that looks good. He's trying to teach me how to do gutters. <laughs> he's doing just fine. This is Mountain Remodel. My dad's been working on houses my entire life. And in those 16 years, he's never had a place to store his tools. He used to load the Suburban full of his tools anywhere he could, including in my seat. Or he'd leave the tools on the job site where they'd get stolen or damaged. But now he's got this nice, very nice, 6 by 12 enclosed lockable trailer. And it looks good. We've got all the windows changed in the basement. It was a big job. We took out the old metal frames. Then we made these wood frames for the new windows. Got the windows in, got the trim in, and my job today is to caulk it. I've seen a lot of guys who don't know what they're doing, and I hope I'm not one of those guys. We're almost done with the windows. The last thing to do is paint. I've already wiped them down, and I'm going to lay something down in case I get paint everywhere. My dad won't fire me. Uh, it's a pretty small job. I could use a brush, but I'm going to try to use this roller and then touch it up with a brush. Ooh, I got it everywhere. I really like working on these old houses. Every one we do, I learn more and more. Like them guys teaching me gutters, I really appreciate that. I notice that the neighbors always seem happy when we show up to fix these old houses. Like, for example, this one has been sitting abandoned for over 10 years, and now it's starting to come together. I've been painting this trim for a while and I've had a lot of time to think. I've realized that there's a much faster way. We should have painted it before we put it up. I think my dad's just teaching me how to paint. You know, I've walked past that thing a couple times and I've been wondering what it is. It says it's a central vacuum system. I've heard about these. This unit was high dollar in its day, and it's probably high dollar now. I wanna see if it'll work, but somebody stole the wire to this too, so I'll find some wire and hook it up. I've got an old extension cord to test the central back. I've got all my tools over here. My wire strippers, utility knife. I've got to be careful on this. I've seen more people get hurt on these than any other tool. Always cut up, not towards me. These old wires are really brittle. It's going to be hard to hook up. My 
my extension cord. It's color coded so it's easy. Just twist them together. I could just twist them together but this is a lot safer even though it's just temporary I still want to be as safe as I can. Now that I've got all the wires hooked up I'm just going to plug it in and hopefully it'll work. Okay. Okay, maybe I'm missing something. Let me check my wiring again. Make sure everything's real tight. All my wires are connected. Everything's good. Try it one more time. Maybe I'm missing something. Oh! I had a toggle switch. Now that I know this works, I'll get my electrician to hook it up. If I didn't test it, I'd just be wasting time and he, wasting his time and my money. Uh, this is going to be a real nice house.